We've won one. We've lost one. It all comes down to the last game in the group against Czech Republic. Surely a point should be enough to see us through. But let's go and find out as we continue on to see if I'm tailor-made to win the Euros. <laughs> Hello, 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 people. Welcome back to the channel. It's me, TaylorMade Gaming, back at you once again with another video. And today we've got episode three of TaylorMade to win the Euros. And it's a massive game today. Last one in the group. We are playing the Czech Republic. And this situation in between me recording the intro and just now has got a little bit more complicated for us to get out of the group because if we have a look at the group table Croatia have beaten Scotland in their last game so Croatia have got four points Scotland have got four points we have got three and so anything could happen in this game if God forbid we lose we are definitely out because Czech Republic will top the group on five points. Uh, a draw puts us on four points, but obviously the goal difference would only put us in second. So that is us getting through, but we might not get as nice a draw as what we would like in the next round. A win for us sees us top the group. So everything to play for going into this last game and just before we do get into the game as ever i want to say thank you to dodgy gamer for making this database it's been a lot of fun to play so far i hope it's been a lot of fun for you guys to watch in the last two episodes of this series and as ever if you would like to download this database Go and check out Dodgy's introduction video to the database. The link to that will be down below. And the links to the database and all that will be in Dodgy's video. So go and check that out and give him, say hello to him and give him a sub. He is this close as we are recording to a thousand subs. So please do go and subscribe to him and push him over that mark. That would be phenomenal. And uh, enough waffling, enough rambling. I am so nervous about this game. Let's go and have a look at the team. We've made a couple of tactical changes. And as you can see, most of the changes are in the middle of the field. As we have pushed Phil Foden back deeper a little bit. But... We've put Madison and Jude Bellingham, who's coming into the team from the start today, to replace Jordan Henderson. We're pushing them two up a little bit more. We're putting them on attack. Foden is on support. Grealish keeps his place on the left. Sancho keeps his on the right. Everybody else keeps their places. Bertrand, Maguire, Rice and Arnold are the back four. Pope is the goalkeeper and Harry Kane is up front for this huge game. As long as we don't lose, we should, should, should be okay. Can you tell I'm nervous? Here we are back in the Wembley dressing room. And I'm going to say, I don't want to say we only need a point. That might make the lads get a bit complacent. Uh, let's give the fans a performance. Only Bellingham has had any reaction to that. Brilliant. Absolutely fantastic. No idea what to predict for this, but I'm going to go... You know what? Let's be optimistic. 3-1 win. Come on, England. 10 seconds into the game, and the Czech Republic are coming forward with the ball, and Sancho does trip... Holozek up, but we uh, we don't have a penalty given against us. As now Czech Republic still have the ball. Going to Derrida. 
and I'm not liking this start to the game. We're looking nervy. I don't think we've had a single touch on the ball yet. As now Barak with the ball and Slick with it. And oh, 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 that was almost a nightmare start. And now lots of highlights to start this game off. Declan Rice now with the ball. Goes to Sancho. And Sancho, what can he do with it? He's gone past one man. He needs to pass it here. He's tried to, but he's given it away. But Foden picks it up for us. Grealish with a long shot is blocked. And now Bertrand. Bertrand coming forward. Come on, just get this ball into the box. He does. He crosses it. Bellingham with the header. And Jude Bellingham with a goal for England to give us the lead. 90 seconds into the game. Oh, that is how you start a game of football, lads. We can all keep calm now. As our oh, thank God for that. Bertrand with a great cross to find Bellingham and a very nice header to put the ball into the back of the net. Five minutes into the game and Czech Republic are coming through. Slick synchronised. Oh no. Patrick Slick. Oh. A point might be enough to see us. A point will be enough to see us through. But I want to win the game. I do not want this at all. Jankto with a beautiful through ball and Slick just putting it past Pope. If we get through, Pope might be getting dropped. Almost 20 minutes gone. Loads of highlights at the start of this game. As now Czech Public are in. Slick with the shot and thankfully our man there manages to block it as it goes out for a corner ball. Czech Republic are having way too many chances for my liking. As now Derrida with the outswinging corner. Can we get a white shirt on this? And yes, we do. And now Derrida picks it up. And on, win this ball back, please. Saluska, Derrida. Come on, let's win this back. And nothing happens. It's looking like another Czech Republic highlight. Pavlenka with the goal kick. He goes long. And can we win this back? No, we don't. Slock nods it down. And Barak is in. Barak is in. And Czech Republic have scored. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. As it stands, we are going out. If we are to go home, thankfully, we're not going to have to travel that far. But this... Has been a roller coaster of a first 20 minutes. Oh my days. Ah, uh, that wasn't the first 45 minutes I wanted. We are now 45 minutes from absolute disaster. We are 2 1 down. We've had nine shots to their 11, four on target each, but their XG has been much better. 0.86 to 1.32. Something needs to change, doesn't it? Uh, before we do the team talk, let's have a look. What can I do for the tactics? I kind of want to go 4 3 3, but I'm, I don't know if that'll work. Ah, oh, sod it. Sod it. Balls to the absolute wall. Rashford coming on for Sancho. And, ooh, Calvert-Lewin or Ivan Tony. Calvert-Lewin, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Tony. And Kane as the advanced forward. The other two is deep line forwards. I think we go for that. Then hit early crosses. Uh, distribute to target man. A higher defensive line, higher line of engagement. Or actually, or do we go? We go four three one two. Yeah, we do. Yeah, we do. We put Rashford in there. Yeah, we put Rashford in there just because, just because the extra pace. That's all it is. Kane as a target man on attack. 
and Calvert Lewin as an advanced forward. I think I've lost my mind. But 45 minutes to rescue this. Oh my gosh. Oh, please, please. Come on, we can do this. We can do this. I expect to see a much better showing. And yep, everyone is motivated. Come on, 45 minutes, one goal is all we need. Two minutes into the second half. And once again, it's a Czech Republic goal kick. And it gets flicked on again. And our defence just has just cannot work against their front men, apparently. Their cross is blocked. And Kadarabek with it. And oh, can we win this back? No, we can't. Not just yet. Oh, yes, we do. Madison clears it. Calvert Lewin, can he turn? You've got Rashford. Play the ball. Play the ball, man. Thankfully, he has, but maybe a little bit too late. But Rashford squared it. And Harry Kane saves us for the minute. Oh. Also, I'm a tactical genius. That was all down to me. Have a look at this. Calvert Lewin with the pass eventually to Rashford. And then he squared it. And Kane beat his man. And with the easiest goal he will ever score, it's 2-2. It's still on for us to win this, boys. Oh, half an hour left to go. Czech Republic are coming forward. Boril with the cross. Sutek with the header. And thankfully, for once, Sutek doesn't score with his head. Oh, two minutes later, it's us coming forward. But we have lost the ball. And there's nobody in that midfield. Jankto now coming forward. And Slick is in. Oh, no, 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 no. Pope with the save. Pope has remembered he can save shots on goal. But now it's them with the corner ball. Derrida with it. And Sick with the header. And oh, I think that counts as pretty much a clearance off the line. And now Calvert-Lewin on the counter for us. He's got, I think that's Rashford with him. Calvert-Lewin, can he find him? He has eventually. Penalty! Penalty ref. No! No penalty there. And now, us coming forward again. Foden loses the ball, but it only goes as far as Rice. And Hovorica has headed it away. Jankto plays it forward, and we get it there. Declan Rice, always you like, goes back to Pope. And this highlight just does not want to end, does it, boys? Now, Holozek coming forward again. He's got a little bit of space. He's gone for the shot. And thankfully, we survive. Non-stop all the highlights in this game. And now we've got the ball. Kane, Rashford's in. Rashford, you're already a national treasure. But he's confirmed it there. Cool as you like. Running past the keeper. And we are three to up. We have been in every position in the group during this game. We've started the day in third, went down to fourth. We've been second, and now we are topping the group. Oh, the drama's not over yet, though. Czech Republic coming forward, but the, but we get the ball as it goes back to Rashford. And now Kane is forward. Kane, oh no, he's lost it there. Do we take a gamble and take Kane off? Because he's looking a little bit tired. As now Hlozek clears it, but only as far as Jankto. Jankto is in, and oh, come on, we need to get this ball away. Yes, we do. And Rashford, come on. Rashford coming forward with the ball. He's got to pass it here. He has Harry Kane with the shot, and yes. Breathe, boys. Breathe. We are through. And yeah, with that goal, we are taking Harry Kane off. Get Ivan Tony on. Just go tell me how tall Ivan Tony is to see if he can play target man. Uh, no, it's not. Oh, well, well, target man is apparently his best role anyway. So Ivan Tony is coming on for Harry Kane. And thankfully, surely we're through. 20 minutes left. Havorica, who Boril. Come on, one more goal, one more goal, just to make absolutely sure, would be beautiful. As Trent picks the ball up for us, Declan back to Pope. 
and Pope, under no pressure, can take as long as he wants. He goes long, and that goes to nobody in a white shirt. And now they have gone long. Alexander Arnold to Tony to Jude Bellingham. Can he play the ball out wide? You would like him to. He has Trent with the ball, and the cross is in. That's a beautiful cross. Dominic Calvert Lewin makes it five. It was never in doubt, was it, lads? Never, ever in doubt. You weren't nervous. I wasn't nervous. Nobody was nervous. And yes, beautiful cross here from Trent Alexander Arnold. Calvert Lewin with the header. Is that his second goal of the game today? I think it might be. And now another highlight. Loads of highlights in this game. Can we please just get this game over and done with? Boreal with the cross into Darida. Bellingham clears. Tony with the header. And Calvert Lewin has it. Can he get past his man? He has. Could he possibly make it six? Oh, I thought that was six. Oh, there we go. It is a 5 2 win. What a mental game. Especially that first half. So much drama in that first half. But once we made the tactical change, it was never in doubt. I think that 4-3-1-2 is what we're going to go with for the rest of the tournament. As we have had 21 shots to Czech Republic's 20, 11 on target to their 6, and an XG of 2.73 to their 2.37. And let's get into the dressing room. Let's go. Outstretched, up, outstretched arms even. What a comeback that was. And everybody's inspired and motivated. And let's go and skip forward to the end of the group stages. See who we're going to get. And then that's where we'll leave it for today. Okay, all the groups have now been played. And going through them in order. In group A, Switzerland... Turkey and Italy have all qualified from that group. Unfortunately, my adopted home nation of Wales have lost all three games. But if you are a Welshman, if you are a Wales fan, do not fear. Because after this series has ended, I'm going to be trying to win the Euros with Wales. So all hope is not lost. Or maybe it is, if you've seen some of my management in this series. But, however, in Group B, Denmark and Belgium have got through, rather unsurprisingly. In Group C, Holland and Austria have got through that one. And in Group D, us, Croatia and Scotland have all qualified. What a group that was. A lot of drama in, that, in our particular group. And in Group E, Spain, Slovakia and Poland have all made their way out of that one. Spain only topping the group by one goal. Little bit surprising, maybe. Sweden have gone out. Maybe they, they didn't have Slatan playing for them like in, how they won't have in real life. And in Group F, of course, France, Germany and Portugal have all made it through. Portugal only winning the one game, which might help us. Because if we look at the second round, we have got Portugal. What a game that is going to be. Italy have got France. Holland have got Croatia. Denmark, Turkey. Spain, Scotland. Poland versus Switzerland. Belgium versus Germany and Slovakia versus Austria. And so that is where we are going to leave it. We are going to have our game against Portugal in the next episode. If you've enjoyed this video and this series so far, pop a massive thumbs up down below. Subscribe to the channel for more Football Manager 2021 content, TEW 2020 content, and a lot more other stuff is coming to the channel. And follow me on Twitter at Taylor M Gaming. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Come on, England.